Ooh la la, ooh la la. How is everybody? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Grab your coffee. I'm wearing this underestimate me, that'll be fun shirt because we have defeated the enemy and I can't wait to share my testimony. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my live. God is always good and he's especially even better to his kids when there's so much chaos and destruction. So tune in, you'll, you'll have hope and faith that everybody needs right now. So grab your coffee. It's Thursday. We've almost made it. I am thanking God for the miracles. I was up praying for anybody who's in my community page. Uh, or, I don't know. I was, God woke me up at 12, 12, and I was up until 3, 30, 3, I think. I know, powerful spiritual numbers. And I knew there was a miracle coming. I was arming everybody of what to pray in terms of how to hold the vision for healing and health for my sister who's been fighting for her life and the breakthrough came so i'm excited to share this with you i was gonna post it because i was so tired and overcome overwhelmed with the battle guys the battles have been intense and it, you're not alone if you've been feeling spiritual warfare spiritual warfare has been intense in these days and you cannot that's no indication of your lack of faith, it's indication of the exact opposite. It's an indication of what is to come. It's an indication of, I know it's been really rough. I know, I know. I've been battling like I've never battled before. Yesterday, I was walking with my husband. We always walk four miles. I couldn't do it. I said, I, honey, I have to turn around early. I fasted way too long. Like, it's just the way it worked, you know? You ever, anyways, whatever. So God is good. I've got worship in this ear. It's really weird to have, it's surreal to have worship in this ear and be talking to you, but that's how I roll these days because we need some miracles. Amen. And guys, you guys have been seeing financial miracles. I'm so grateful. So thankful. Thank you for sharing your testimonies. Always share your testimonies, guys. This is a kingdom channel. People need to be able to come here and see that miracles are happening here. Amen. Now there's, this is the biggest faith. This is the biggest um, health miracle I've ever seen in my life because in the past I've always... Thank you, Lonnie. Thank you. <laughs> Excellent. I need to share my link with him. Hold on. He's my 10 o'clock, right? And I was like, I was, uh, there's a lot of noise here. It's okay, guys. We're still, my husband's still finishing up, finishing touches. And you rock. Talk to you you then thank you lonnie thanks everybody thank lonnie and adamson who's coming on probably because i just sent him um <clears throat> okay uh here i'm gonna say 10 30 okay uh sorry guys it's been a busy, crazy day, but that's what it is when you're going through spiritual warfare. Um, it just is what it is, right? Uh, you just have to roll with it, but main, remaining calm in the midst of chaos, like the sound of the uh, the vacuum in, in my background. It... Coffee with friends, though, is worth it. Good morning. We're going to praise the living God this morning. Amen, amen, amen. Guys, I've been going three minutes, 33 seconds. Okay, listen. I battled last night. I battled all day yesterday. I felt weary. I felt in my mind, it was like, is this all worth it, God? I really don't understand all this warfare. Is this worth it? I awoke. I went to bed tired. Uh, I did talk to my brother-in-law and he was saying that he had a fit with the doctors. They were getting ready to move her to one of those ventilation centers, one of those rehab centers where people on ventilators just go to stay there. Right. So <laughs> he like the spirit and the spirit of his hus of husbandry rose up in him and he goes, no way. It hasn't been 10 days yet. It's only been six days. He fought for her. Guys, you've got to fight for your rights on this earth right now. They are taking shortcuts. So you don't let them. Right. I'm not saying the staff there. I'm sure they saved her life. They've done their best. But but. If it hadn't been for her husband being his her proponent. So listen, I knew the time was short. Otherwise, she'd end up on that forever. Um, fasting, praying, interceding, uh, sharing my love for Jesus Christ. We're using the 
coffee gets me started. Jesus keeps me going cup today. I, I mean, I can't, I can't do anything else to say I'm sold out for Christ. I have been for 23 years, ever since he showed up in my Jeep. That was the first miracle. Second miracle was my miracle husband. He came before Jesus showed up, but I knew it was him. Um, I knew it was my mom in heaven too. Cause yeah. Anyways. So what's the miracle? I woke up in bed. I'm laying there scheduling my day. I usually do stuff before I even get out of bed because the warfare is thick, right? So I'm worshiping and I get a call from my brother-in-law and I answer and he's in her room. They took out the ventilator. I was able to talk to her. She can't talk because her vocal cords are sore. She's had a tube down her throat for six days. So she's off the ventilator, breathing on her own. Praise God. Now, listen. <laughs> so he goes, do you want to talk to her? And I go, yes. And I said, my sister, you will live and not die. The word says you will live and not die. This is my restoration season. You're coming with me. I'm going to go on a road trip. I'm going to come visit you. I'm going to give you some of my incredible products. And you're going to take them and I'm going to buy them for you. And you're healed. You're getting out of there. I, sh I shared with her the vision of God gave me that she was being wheeled out because that's what hospitals do. I said, girlfriend, I know you don't want, I, I mean, my sister, I know you don't want to be there. You know, this hospitals like that killed my mother. So, you know, she's the same age as my mother. I, it was not going to happen. I knew this was a curse on my bloodline to take me down, right? And I, I'm not making it all about me, but come on, the enemy. I, look what we're doing here. 14,000 and growing. Woohoo! <laughs> I just got a check. Uh, my husband just showed it to me. One seventy a dollar seventy one checks in the mail a dollar seventy one it was whatever was left when I paid off my jeep I paid off a little too much I guess so cheers praise be to God God is doing miracles guys God is doing miracles you have to believe Venezuela opening their borders Monday for trade that would be great for those holding the you know the boulevards. Uh, good morning God please heal Deborah's sister yes she guys she's off the ventilator that is huge. That is a huge victory in this, this series of victories and miracles she needs, but I'm believing for, I cast the vision for her. I told her husband, before you go to sleep, this is what I said to her husband, before you go to sleep tonight, I know you're tired. You've had your dinner. I said, lay down rest, but visualize Debbie smiling, you wheeling her out of the hospital through the door. She's free. She can come home, resume her walking program. Right. And so I told him what to do. And I, I, Oh man, I sent, I sent a video that God led me to send with the right song to, to all my prayer warriors or all the people that know me and that would pray. And that's what we come for guys to pray, to, to see miracles on this earth, right? Uh, too many people have been believing, but not seeing miracles. And on this channel, we don't stop at just saying, oh, it's going to be okay. We stop at, oh, thank you. My husband got me a new lap desk. It's beautiful. I'm going to use that. Hold on. Because this one was getting just, it was a, it was a cheers. Coffee time. Guys, we got to celebrate the living God. Miracles, miracles, miracles everywhere. You got to believe in miracles. So much good news out there. I know. What was the other good news? So much good news out there. Deb recovering would be a huge cherry on the top. I know. I know. But to me, it is the, it is the Sunday. <laughs> I'm not letting the devil steal one more member of my family due to heart attacks. That can't, that curse is broken. Heart attacks. Think about that. Think about that. If you're, if you're devoted to God, how could you have a heart attack? What, honey? Oh, okay. Thank you. Anyways, whatever. I'll deal with this after. So guys, miracles upon miracles. I mean, the check coming in the mail, my new lab desk. God is making all things new. By the way, he did give me some words this morning before I got that call and was in tears. Uh, I had to wash my face. I had to wash my face. Um, so here we go. This is what God said. Uh, wait. Uh, Abrahamic covenant blessings are here. Uh, oh, I lost one of my things. Um, again, I was 12, 12 awake. This, this light went off my, my office stove went on. It was like I was led into there and he was just, I drank my reverse age. 
Cheers to reverse age. Anybody drink reverse age? It's amazing. You should do that on an empty stomach. Just do it on an empty stomach. So I do it in the middle of the night when I wake up and need to seek God. Covenant blessing. Stand firm to receive it. Walk into it. Some of us are getting new homes. Some of us are getting new homes. Who wants a new home? Amen. Who wants a home? Right? In the world, they're talking about nobody can afford a new home with the interest rate solidly at 7%. And that's if you have good credit. What do the peasants do? I go, what does us peasants do? We're all peasants compared to the elite, right? The, uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, in the kingdom, you're not a peasant. You're royalty. Adjust your crown every morning. Realize covenant blessings stand firm to receive. Okay. He's been saying miracles upon miracles upon miracles. Stand firm to receive. So what did I do? I did my work yesterday. I kept my faith up. When I talked to Brian, I reminded him that God is still on the throne and that a lot of people were praying for her and that she was going to be healed. I, I addressed him of how to pray for her in the positive, not any of the negative stuff. Like so many people are praying and not speaking in alignment with what God's covenant promises are. This is covenant blessing, guys. What The wealth transfer is a covenant blessing. I didn't, I didn't show you all that. Some of that was personal for me. The debt discharge. Some of you need debt discharged. I decree and declare God would discharge your jet debt miraculously. Um, I decree and declare that you would see newness in your life in every area. I'm so thankful like that we're here together for this. I'm so thankful that that check came in the mail at the right time, right? Uh, because God led us to pay off our vehicles, right? So we paid off our vehicles, and and we're we're hunkering in, right? Because it. In the world, it's going to get cray cray, but in the kingdom, you're going to be here having coffee and we're going to be rejoicing. We're going to be talking about all the miracles. It's going to be amazing. We're going to have natural light in our homes when it's darkness. People are talking about it's going to get dark. And I'm like, whatever, that's your experience. My experience is going to be joyful having coffee with friends and family talking about the goodness of God. Amen. Everybody needs this. Please share my content. Please share my channel with people. Tell them what we do here. Yes. Oh, Regina, I'm working on it. My next house, yes, we're going to buy it outright. We're going to buy it with cash. We're going to be working with our wealth manager and saying, "Hey, I need you to, you, I need you to, to transfer money." However, they do it, then depending on what system is in place, guys, you need to stop worrying. Trust me, I'm talking to myself as well as I am you. You need to stop worrying about what systems the banks are going to put in place and when. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Why? We're kingdom. God always provides a way out. I'm a financial ninja. I know the way out. He's He prepared me for this before it ever happened. That's the way he works, right? You're in connection with a good person. Yes, Antonio Dallas. Hi, it's nice to see you. I would love a new home. I will receive it in this wealth transfer. Amen, amen. Guys, the wealth is being transferred. What you, The bank failures are the wicked. The wealth is being transferred to the righteous. So what are they going to do? They're going to revalue their currency. They have to revalue their currency. Uh, and it's going to, we're going to be able to exchange it. Out of world was on earth. She needs healing frequency, Nikola Tesla. Well, yeah. Well, whenever. I mean, that's not in her backyard right now. So I'm working with what I got. Amen. And glory to God is all I need. I don't need man's inventions. I don't even care if it was Nikola Tesla. God is my healer. God is my provider. I don't look to man for what I need. I look to God. If God brings that in my path and I, I like, for example, when I needed healing back when I was 36 and just God just moved us to Maine and I prayed for healing, he brought me a product through a person. I took that product and look at me today. I'm healed. I have none of the, I broke the curses off my family because I was obedient to take it and I was open to hear from him. And the miracles happened, right? And I went on to help other people. It's like the widow with oil. What do you have in your house? I shared it with a lot of people and God built me a multi-million dollar business till a malignant narcissist who was full of demons decided they wanted it and they wanted to try to take it. God didn't let them. I still have it. The business is still there. It was on life support for a while. Um, it's provided very well for tax donations all the while, right? Because you use the tax laws to your benefit. You use the systems to your benefit. Um, somebody was on there going, I'm confused because these, these credible channels say, if you don't go to a, what do they call it? What do they call it? They call it a redemption center, right? Jesus is my redeemer. Amen. I think people should be able to have choices and choose. 
they're not, they're not giving you a choice. They're going in one way only. I'm like, Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. I just, I, I'm a financial person. I audited banks. I know a little bit about the banking system. I know what they're good at and I know what they're not good at. They're not good at stewarding your money. That's for darn sure. Unless they're using it to make them money. So you know that and you use it to your advantage. So I provide a different strategy. I get it. Most people are not financial. They don't understand how it works. It's all a mystery box of evil to them. Well, it's the world we live in. And if you if you know the ways around it, wisdom is provided by many counselors. That's a proverb. Uh, I'm just one of your counselors. Heavenly and monthly. You need some money. Amen. Yes, Michelle, my husband and I are on the way. Same thing. Same thing. Amen. And I pray that for everybody. I pray for everybody on here that all your debts are cleared. However, God leads you to do it, guys. When I was, when I was, I told you God led me into debt so I would know what it feels like so I could relate, so I could have empathy. Compassion flows for me if you're in debt. I know I don't I never judge you. I don't sit off my high horse, never had any problems with debt telling you what you should do. I don't do that. No, I've been there. I'm just like you. I have been, I've needed healing. I've needed miracle provision. I've needed to rebuke the enemy from him attacking me all the time through people. Narcissism usually, but you know, I'm not going to stand in judgment of a fellow brother or sister that confesses to be follow God, but when they perform evil, they'll reap what they sow. I don't have to judge them. God does. Aren't prayers just metaphysics? Kind of, but guys, I got to tell you, all the people that are the greatest metaphysics, metaphysicians in there, you know, I don't know about that. All I know that the risen Christ showed up in my Jeep. I know he's real. I studied his word because I'm in his kingdom now and I'm teaching people how to master this kingdom. This kingdom that is different than everybody else. This kingdom that promises he, God gives you the power to get wealth and he adds no sorrow with it, right? There's no sorrow with wealth that God gives you, right? I'm in a stage, age and stage in my life where the wealth transfer is happening. I'm participating in it. Why? I have seeds in the ground. Now, if you're just hearing this message and you didn't know that, God can provide for you miraculously out of nowhere. Believe me, God used people to bless me before. God uses all sorts of things to bless his people. You just need to get in with some good people. Um, um, Dragonfly, I'm sorry. I will pray for you. That sucks. Um, have your emotions. Remember, God says, be angry. Do not sin. Be angry, feel it. I I have no problem with emotions on this channel. You should not put a sticky figure, st sticky figure. You should not put a sticky happy face on your negative emotions. Feel your emotions. I'm I'm here for you, girl. Uh, her tax refund was deposited. It's over four hundred dollars short. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to say about that. Just pick your battles wisely. Trust God. Whatever's stolen from you, God. Re re if you catch the devil in his lies. He's required to repay you sevenfold, the devil, right? Devil was trying to steal my sister from me. And what? Most conventional wisdom would be, oh, I'm sorry. That's your history, all that. No, my history was redeemed when I came into the kingdom. Just saying. I don't know. I don't know, guys, the metaphysics versus that. I'm not equipped to talk about that. All I know is my own experience. And I will tell you that Jesus Christ is all I need. His Holy Spirit that's living in me is all I need. I know how to get my prayers answered. I know to pray only positive prayers. I know that I only speak life and not death out of my life. Life and death is in the power of the tongue. When I speak to people, I am healthy. I am healed. I walk in divine health. If I get a headache, I don't I don't act like it's, oh, my God, I might have a tumor. You know, some people do that. They curse their own life and they will reap what they sow with their tongue. The tongue is a mighty rudder. You got to cover. Trust me, I have a mighty tongue. I have a big mouth. I had to learn how to tame it. I had to learn how to speak in accordance with God's word and God's word alone. Not in accordance with what the world says. Not in accordance with what the doctors say. We have elevated doctors high above what they should be elevated at. I'm not saying there's not a place for doctors. Of course there is. Just like there's a place for accountants like me. Just like there's a place for, for uh, public auditors like me. Just like there's a place for firefighters and EFT. You know, 
but but that doesn't mean they are above God, right? It depends on as you, it will be done for you as you have believed. I knew my sister would be healed and she's going to be rolled out of that hospital free. And I don't even believe she's going to be on any medications, but we'll see. And if she is, I'll work her off of them because I'm, I'll drive down there and make her take my shakes until she loves them. I'm just saying, I'm not going to put up with their nose anymore. This is serious time now. We got to. We got to make sure we get healthy guys. And my products are the best way to get healthy. I will, I will be shouting this from the rooftops as long as I live. Uh, this pastor that I helped, he was a, uh, a first, he was a independent Baptist minister, man. That guy knew the Lord. He knew his Bible. He loved me after he got to know me because he knew I knew my word might've been different versions. We talked about that all the time. King James all the way. I said, I'm sorry, but, but, I need, I need a version that doesn't have the valve and those in it. Right. So he began to understand and we had a mutual respect for each other, but he got his life back because of these products. And on his deathbed, he was like, keep taking your relive, keep qualifying, keep sharing it with people because it changed his life. He went from taking thousands of dollars worth of nutritionally prescribed supplements, doctor prescribed supplements. He went to all sorts of healers. Nothing was working. He gets on relive and he's feeling better. He even called my husband before I even got home and he was 20 minutes away and said, how could this stuff be working already? It is not a placebo effect, guys. He literally had doctors. My friend KC had his grip strength. He had rheumatoid arthritis so bad that his grip strength was like the number and then it went and it improved because he's on the relive products. I'm just saying. Christian Garcia, thank you. Let me write you down. You will not be lost in the bunch, but thank you for showing up on my chat and saying that. And thank you, God, that I saw it because he didn't even put any emojis in. Hi, Melly. I'm just making sure I didn't get lost in the bunch. I paid $37 for 15 minutes through cash up on Monday night. I emailed and texted. They required him from having her back. Christian Garcia, oh my gosh, I apologize. Guys, I've been, I've been battling for my sister's life, so I apologize. As a Christian, thank you for forgiving me. I will fit you in. Let me... I. I got to write notes, guys, just like when God speaks to me, it's usually handwritten. It doesn't usually come through my typewriter. Um, Christian Garcia, I will. What is your flexibility today? Can you get in today sometime? I got to walk with my husband at some point, but I will fit you in. Um, best time for me right now is, let me think. Um, hold on. I'm trying to think. I switched some things around so I could do this live this morning and encourage y'all. Um, hold on. Uh, guys, I want you to know, I would never intentionally not help somebody. <laughs> like, seriously. Um, my husband's getting a boat delivered, so he has to be here. I could do noon. I could do, I could do 1215, 1230 Eastern time. Does any of those times work for you? Christian, let me know, comment down below and I'll book it. Um, yes, guys, miracle. My sister is off the ventilator and I was able to speak to her and she was smiling and nodding her head. Guys, she's finally coming out of the fog. She was in a medically induced coma, guys. It took a while. I was praying that God would supernaturally get that stuff out of her system so she her body could take over because I knew her body's healed, and, but she needs to get her strength back. So keep praying for her. Keep seeing her released and getting stronger every day. Amen. I bought Dinars five days ago. So excited. Thanks for the inspiration. Dwayne, hey, it's hey, what do we got to lose? We got to stay diversified. We're in the old. This is the old banking system, guys. And with the currencies, they're going to revalue them. This is a good thing for us. I mean, it's a, it's a pivotal, it's a good time to be in foreign currencies when they want that system to stay. Because it's the only way they have no, you know, if it's gold backed or asset backed, they have accountability. They don't really want that. Have you noticed? Just say it. Your sister has more work to do. Relax. I know. I know. But so does God. God told me she would live and not die. And I had to stand firm. Guys, the covenant blessing is you have to stand. I, I'm sorry, I'm pointing at you. Um, I know that probably triggers somebody. Um, the covenant blessing is stand firm to receive it, walk into it. Some people are getting new homes. Some people are getting literally like, like a debt cancellation. Like I've gotten debt cancellation many times in the kingdom because I didn't have anything to do to 12 PM. Sounds perfect. 
Yes, thank you. Make sure you text me. Can you text me a few minutes before 12 and say, hey, it's me. If you have my text number, please text me because uh, it's hard for me to schedule while I'm, hold on, while I'm mid-live. Uh, guys, I'm trying to serve everybody. So listen, somebody was in chat and I really feel for these people. Oh, I already discussed that. Didn't I? Didn't I discuss it? Check your food. We found metal in our land of lakes. Ooh, I never do land of lakes. Guys, I eat, I eat organic as much as possible. I haven't been, I haven't had the energy at night, guys. I just eat and I sleep. I've had no energy to uh, post pictures of my brilliant food. We had swordfish last night. My husband made it for me because he knew I was busy. He had no idea I was talking to Brian because I was doing so many appointments yesterday, helping y'all prepare for this wealth transfer. Um, Samantha, Marsha Boyd, Samantha needs appointment too. Samantha, is it 15 minutes? If you paid me, get in my chat and say, I paid you on this day, this time. I will find it and and uh, we'll get you started. Because guys, I'm just, I paid for a half ninja with emojis. Please don't let me slip through the, Samantha Adnip, thank you. Hold on, I won't let you slip through the cracks. Uh, hold on, we got Christian, Samantha. Guys, thank you for getting in the chat and let me know. Guys, this is the only way I can stay in touch with you guys. You wouldn't believe my emails. I mean, I get a lot of emails, right? And and some of my stuff is coming through junk. So if you get a reply for me, guys, if you get a reply for me, if you read that email, follow the instructions. It tells you what to say. Ooh, la, 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 la. I love you too. Thank you. Guys, I love you. Guys, you know I love you because I was feeling like, like, uh, I was feeling like this emoji. Here, let me show you. This is how I was feeling this morning. I wasn't even smiling. This is how I was feeling. Just see the emojis. Here, let me do it a couple times. This is how I'd be feeling this morning after all the spiritual attacks. Have I, and, and this is before I got the phone call. I was like, I was feeling like, and I was stinky. I still haven't showered. You know why? Because at some point we're going to walk and I'm just going to get sweaty again. So you know what? That's what, that's what washing up is for. I was expecting, listen to this, Beverly, thank you for showing up in my chat and sharing this financial miracle. I see your financial miracles, but then I, I forget them by the time I get to my lives. I was expecting a bonus yesterday of about $50. I got 10 times that. God is great. Going to order Relive. Do I order all three products? Need advice? It depends. If you can, yes. Relive, Energize, comes in lemon or orange. You choose. And, re, and Fiber Store, if you need your cells cleared out. Anybody who's who was, who was, who was deceived and took the medication needs the fiber store. The it's called the super size. Now energized fiber store is the best and it tastes really good. Seriously. And here, here's my link. So you can order it and get on auto ship guys. You save. Thank you, Christian. I love the text. Thank you guys. I love you guys. We're you know, when I started this channel, I'm like, you know what, God, if you build me, because God called me to this, I didn't want to do it. But once I started doing it, I enjoyed it. Because you know what, before God called me to YouTube, when I was in, when I was on vacation, I was sending my friend who was struggling, getting out of a divorce, struggling. I was sending her little videos every day after dinner. I'd go walking, I'd shoot a video and I'd send it to her. I love encouraging people, guys. That was one person. Uh, I'm just, I'm just saying. So guys, you got to get on, get on auto ship. I'm not, pro guys, I know most people don't want to do the business. I've been doing this business long enough to know most people don't want to do what I do. A lot of rejection in it. Well, this is too. Sharing Christ as boldly I do. There's not, you don't only get rejection from people. You get attacked <laughs> viciously. They attack everything. That's just the enemy trying to stop you. Right. And somebody said, oh, bragging is bad. I almost, I almost, I almost muted him. But he had other comments that redeemed him. I'm not going to call you out on it. But it's like, I am never bragging about me. I am just as broken, as flawed as any other human that's willing to admit it. I am not acting like I'm Miss Prissy Princess Perfect. That don't exist this side of heaven. We are in a war. We are in a war between good and evil. And we're caught in the crossfires of the elites that are fighting it. They all want power. I'm just trying to help you survive. I'm trying to help you prepare. It's warfare time. That's why I'm in my camouflage tights, camo tights and, and my uh, 
underestimate me. That'll be fun. You know, because these devils in hell underestimate everybody because you haven't been trained to fight. I teach you how to fight with your spiritual weapons. I'm not talking about going out there. I'm talking about protecting your castle. Do you need to protect it in the 3D world? Yes, you do. That would be required. That would be uh, getting very familiar with your amendment rights and getting educated. There's plenty of places you can go that are low cost where you can learn how to be uh, proficient. You don't want to be if some, you want to be accurate. Amen. So practice. I ate at a restaurant the other night. And I believe that they serve 3D printed meat glue. And oh, pray over everything you eat, guys. God can change whatever nastiness into something good. Pray over it. Just saying, I don't go out to eat at all. We got the, although the takeout, oh my gosh, the takeout Thai food was amazing. And by the way, I had leftovers. I didn't eat all of it. And the five hot spicy, oh, was like 10 the next day. I was like, <laughs> every bite was like, <laughs> But it was good. I'm like, oh, I'm going to get five star again. I love I love some spice. Amen. Prayers and freedom from all the trier stars up and down. Yes, I got to go. I got 15 minutes. OK, let me go check out our wealth transfer because you guys, let's be honest. We all need money. I don't focus on money on this channel, but it is part of God's kingdom because he does want you wealthy. If you think he wants you broke and sick, you don't understand him. His kingdom is health and wealth. Why do you think he put me in business, which was health and wealth? And you know what, guys? I had to not despise the day of small beginnings. I had a lot of small beginnings. Oh, I saw Frank last night. He was doing that kiss thing. Oh, that's all there is on my updates. Evidently, we're supposed to watch Frank 26's video. He looks very happy. Unless it's just not loading. Hold on. Let me go to another browser. Safari. Something's wrong with Safari. I'm not going on Safari anymore. I'm sorry. I wouldn't go on Safari anyway. I love animals too much to shoot them. I let other people deal with it. I don't want to know where it's coming from. I'm just being honest. I just don't like, I just don't like, um, I'll eat it though, because I love, I love me some good food. Um, I'm a foodie. And uh, so anyways, okay, there is more. Thank you, God, that I went to another browser. Okay, Lonnie, I'm going to be ready at 1045. And Christian, I will be calling you at noon. Um Mark Z, my guess or hunches, we are seeing a lot of scrambling as if they are preparing and trying to go between April 1st and 3rd. It actually would not surprise me if we got notices today. It would not surprise me if we got notices in three weeks. It appears that the three-day window is in their targets. Woohoo! Jesus Christ rose from the dead. Three days, this is that season where we celebrate his resurrection. Guys, he showed up in my Jeep. I've been celebrating that for 23 years every day. It's not just once a year. I'm just saying, that's just me. Mountain Goat. Articles, Minister of Transport, the government's vision aspires to transform Iraq into an international trade center between Asia and Europe. Amen. Let it be an international center so their currency rises. And we go to the bank and we get our money. I told you that Iraq is going to be a huge clearinghouse for the Middle East between Asia, China, and Europe, EU. So here it is now in black and white from their own news media. Their words, not mine. No rumors, no hype, no opinions, just the facts. Amen. They cannot possibly continue with this approach with a program rate and not being on internationally traded currency. I agree. You cannot do international trade without having an international tradable currency, which means it needs to be posted on Forex, which means the marketplace will rise it to the level it needs to be at. So whatever it comes out, don't worry, I'll be going live every morning because I ain't signing no nasty non-disclosure agreement with the government. I don't care if you offer me $15. I ain't signing it. Why? Because that's a that's just a reason for them to take it back from you for something you may have not done. Guys, there are so many deep fakes out there. They can make it look like you robbed the store and therefore not wealthy of the thing. I mean, especially as much stuff they have of me. Of course, I don't go into any store, so they have a hard time doing that. Because um, I let my husband do the shopping because he's more, he's more kind. He's more able to deal with normies. He deals with normies on a regular basis. I can't deal with them anymore. I just, I'm sorry. You know why? I should have been, I was, I was torn between the shirt that the t-shirt that says, I'm sorry. Did I roll my eyes out loud? My face betrays me. I see, you know, they see it on my face. I have to, that's why I wear glasses when I walk. And I usually, I don't know. I, I don't look at too many people if they look like they're crazy. Just saying. 
um, militia man in the final stage. What we're expecting is the education of the citizens on the street. We're hearing that the citizens have been told about new things that are coming. And it has to do with their currency, not money, but currency. Yes. Earlier today, the central bank came out. All Alak says they have those. Alak says they have those three packages they launched to create an environment that stabilized the dollar exchange rate. He says the amount of reserves they've acquired from the oil sales is astonishing, about 115 billion. He's basically stating those central bank reserves are within international standards. That's a big thing. Having a massive foreign reserves plus the gold, it supports the value for the currency and it brings it stability. Boom. Do we need to say any more, guys? This thing is done, done, done like Donkey Kong. Guys, I've said this consistently. Guys, I have a prophetic gift about this. I don't know where else my prophetic gift lies, but I did see a vision of my, my sister being rolled out of that hospital, so I knew she was going to live and not die. You know, that's how I've lived my life. So I'm glad you're here. Please subscribe, tap the bell. God has been saying this thing is done for a while, and I just had to stand firm because I'm part of the Abrahamic Covenant. That's why I love my Jewish brothers and sisters. There's no fighting between me and the, the good old Jews. There's no fighting. You are my cousins. I'm grafted in because of your sacrifice. Amen. Jesus Christ was from your, your faith and we are grafted in. So I'm thankful to all the Jews that are still here and still, you know, even if you don't recognize them as a society, I don't judge you for that. I wouldn't have recognized them either had he not shown up in my Jeep, February 22nd, 2000. So we're the same. So I love you, especially Gila. I love you. I posted that. I still love you because she was like, you know, all these people are arguing which, which, uh, which, uh, you know, is right, you know, and I'm like, I pray for everybody to have a revelation of the good, 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 good father that I've had. Amen. Amen. God bless everybody. Let you see peace and prosperity in your house. Let you stand firm to receive. Let you believe that this is the wealth transfer and you are taking part of it right? Amen. Just believe. Amen. So Father God, thank you, Lord, for your miracle check coming in the mail, as if to say my miracle uh, call with my sister. She couldn't talk, but Lord Jesus, I know you're healing her vocal cords as we speak. It was such an honor to be able to speak life into her ear because nobody was speaking life. Toby Max, speak life in the deadest, darkest night. Speak life, speak life to your circumstances, guys. Don't let your mouth speak in alignment with the 3D world, what they want you to speak. Speak life. Amen, 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 amen. And God bless. Lonnie, I hope you're ready for me because we only got 15 minutes. I'm coming in hot. I'm just saying. And everybody else, Samantha, I'm going to fit you in, girl. Uh, do I have your, text me if you have my cell phone number because if I've replied and you've paid, you should have my cell phone number and you should text me. If not, I will I will seek for your email. Hopefully it has your name in it. Amen. God bless. I love you all. Thank you. Just understand what the 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 problem I'm under. If if I get your email, I reply right away with a form. It's Melanie from YouTube. These are the ways you pay me. These are my rates. Da, 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 da. Boom. Send it right away and then it's up to you to text me with the way you pay times you're available. I leave it. It's between you and me. I want it easy for both of us, right? Amen. God bless. Love you. Thank you, Lonnie, for your patience this morning. I was not ready for 10. Amen. I was barely ready to do this at 10. Guys, and you should love the fact that I prioritize you above my paying clients. This is my free stuff, right? This is my tithe unto God's kingdom to tell you to rise and shine. The day for you to rise and shine and fight for your light, your restoration, your financial blessings is now. I hope you will join me in speaking life in the deadest, darkest night. I don't care how dark it looks in your life. I am speaking life to your circumstances. Amen. Listen to Toby Mac's song, Speak Life, right? He was attacked mercilessly too. His son died like a few years ago. And let me tell you, that man has been through it. Anybody who's chosen to worship, whether it's worship through teaching everything I know about the kingdom and his faith and financial in the world, because you need to understand the world's ways in order to navigate this crap. And I understand it all, guys. I understand it from the fiat currencies to the central bank digital currencies, which is their new system that they're implementing right now. We have to be careful. It's modern day digital slavery, okay? And surveillance. You have to be careful of that. That's another reason for a financial ninja appointment. So you can navigate your way free of that. And there's so many lies, guys. They've lied to you over and over again. It doesn't matter what you believe right now. It doesn't matter who you voted for. They're all lying to you. 
wakey, wakey, smell the coffee, come join Truth, Facts, and Optimism channel. I don't know. I don't know if anybody else has it. I do. Amen. I would never lie to you. I can't. My daddy would spank me. Obviously, he's blessing me. He brought me you. Think to yourself, how did you find my channel? How did you find my channel? God led you here. Give him the praise and glory. Not me. It ain't me. This underestimate me. That'll be fun. That's because I'm in the kingdom and I understand the covenant blessing that I live and rule and reign under. I am able to rule and reign in all my circumstances well. I'm able to command the blessing on my storehouse. I'm able to command the blessing on your storehouse until you have the strength to believe it. You're here to get strength so you can start decreeing and declaring, speaking life to all your dead as dark as nights. Amen. I'm just here as a testimony that it's possible. God is still healing. He's raising the dead. Literally, when I first got that call, it looked like she was dead. And yet now, six days later, she's off the ventilator. Okay, speak life. Amen. Stand on the promises of God. Stand on the visions he's given you. If he gave you a vision that you'd have a he'd, you'd have a home in a tropical area like he did me, stand on that. Don't give it up. The enemy wants you to give up your faith. He wants you to believe that God doesn't exist and he's not working miracles. Well, I stand here as a eh, he is working miracles. Thank you for agreeing with me in prayer. Fasting in prayer. Some things come out only by I fasted so much yesterday I almost passed out on my walk. Know your limits. Don't pass out. You could hit your head and then you're then you're in the medical system. Stay out of the medical system. Get on my products. I guarantee you they'll keep you healthy. You can live on my products. Even if you can't find any food, you can live on my products. Amen? Because you can. I do, practically. I exist on them. I don't eat that much because I'm fasting so much, right? But I do have one good meal a day plus my relive shakes. Amen? I love you all. I hope this helped. Amen. Please comment down below if this helped you. Please comment down below. I need to hear from you. I need to hear that this helped. I need to hear your miracle testimonies. I need to hear when you get a hundredfold, when you get a thousandfold for your donation. So everybody else could understand how the kingdom works. There's a bunch of people out there that don't want to give any money away because they're afraid of the lack, the deflation of the dollar. Guys, you cannot outgive God. He rebukes the devourer. What is the devourer? The systems that are causing the inflation that is stealing the money from your pockets. He provides enough for you to pay for your taxes, right? Who's the devourer? Th th those agencies that take your money, right? And keep you poor. Job stands for just over broke, right? That's why I teach people how to use the tax systems to your benefit by having a home-based business, right? Even if you don't really do it, you have to do a minimum, right? I love you. I can help you in every way. Let me hear from you. God bless. I love you. Please comment down below your miracle testimonies, guys. I'm here to glorify God, not myself. Everybody gets it wrong. They see me. They think I'm bragging. I'm, I am nothing without the living God. I am nothing without the Holy Spirit living in me, speaking through me. I don't even know what I've said, right? The Holy Spirit is trying to encourage you. He's just using me as a vessel because I'm surrendered my mouth unto the kingdom of God for his use to give you whatever you need so you can you can survive and thrive because you're not meant to just survive. You're not supposed to be living out in Lodi bar. You're supposed to be eating at the King's table every day. This is a feast of word for you today. Did I, did I give you word today? I don't remember, but it's okay. God loves you. Amen. God bless.